girl. Thank you, baby. Thank you. All right, so I got my numbers up. So hopefully y'all can hear me. Okay, while well, I got my numbers up, anybody who is on my only page, or uh, we can keep fans, I'm going live after this. If you're not on my regainkfans.com page, you need to get there because that's where I clap, that's where I twerk, that's where I have all my fun at, over there, regainkfans.com. Okay, so that's first of all. First and foremost. Good morning. I mean, good afternoon. Yes, that's where you get all your booty views from, all that, whatever you're talking about. So, no, I'm not going to be shaking my butt on here. You can go to regankfans.com for that. Exactly. Exactly right here. Somebody said you better get to regankfans.com because it's a lit. All right. Like me, I like to Hey. Okay. I don't know if y'all can hear me or y'all can't. And I know who's going to tell me. Okay. Can y'all hear me? Y'all gotta let me know if y'all can hear me. Hey. Hey, 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 hi, hi, hey. The site is fire. Thank you very much. You gotta go to regankfans.com for all the class and all that kind of stuff. Okay. But let's get into it though. Okay, so this is what I have to say this morning. So I have been putting out, like, you know, everything that I've been achieving and stuff like that, right? So I've been getting messages saying that, um, oh, let me start uh, only and all that kind of stuff, right? It has nothing to do with how much money you make. It's all about money management. That's what it's about. It's about how you manage and maintain your money and also your credit. You have to clean your credit, establish your credit. Any situation can be a life-changing situation for you. I've had times where I got a job at Walmart and Walmart Pharmacy as a pharmacy technician. And that was life-changing money for me. I think it was a $3 pay rate increase. That was life changing for me because I was able to go get an apartment, a better apartment. So it can, any situation can be life changing for you. Any money can be life changing money for you, but it's about your money management and about you fixing your credit and getting your credit straight. Notice that I've had an OnlyFans for three years. It took me three years to mess up figure it out, and then get on the right track, and then get serious about it. It took three years for that. So within these three years and with the right financial advice, I'm now able to obtain more things, and I'm going to keep going. And not only that, but you have to save your money. You have to save your money. You have to save your money. You establish your credit, you use that credit, and you pay your credit. You pay your credit cards, pay it on time. Please pay it on time. Don't think, you know, you max out the credit cards and then you leave it as is. No. Keep building and establishing that credit. Then they're going to trust you with more money, with more credit. Then you don't have to use your cash. You use their credit and then you pay it back. That's what you do. And don't live beyond your means. By Don't live beyond your means. You guys, anybody who was around me, it was a gradual process for me. And it's still a gradual process for me because I plan on doing more for myself. By the grace of God, I pray to God that I do. 
So I'm saying, y'all don't think that, oh, you just uh, get a whole bunch of money and then your life has changed. Y'all see all these people get a whole bunch of money and then they go broke? They get that money, they go broke because of poor money management skills. Okay? Don't get your money and go out there and spend that money on a club. Why would you rent a sofa for the night for a few hours when you can make your life situation better? If you're living with somebody, you can take that money, you can go get your own spot and save up in that spot until you could buy a house. You know what I'm saying? It's a gradual process. Trust the process, though. And if you know this, to be honest with you, like, I love, I love my sex person. Shout out to D. Charles. I love my sex person, but you can ask D. Charles. I have not stepped in sex in about a year. I haven't stepped in sex in about a year, maybe more. Because it comes to a point where you either want this designer stuff and you want to mess up your money or you want to get serious about it and you want to, you know, take your money and build your money up and then make the right move. You feel me? So all I'm saying is take your take six to nine months and get real, real serious about saving. Get real serious about building and establishing your credit. There are a lot of people out here that offer uh, financial literacy. You know, you just take it full advantage of these things. And with these things, the sky is the limit. Okay, the limit is not the sky. The sky is the limit. You just got to get real serious about you. Get real serious about yourself. Get real serious about educating yourself. Okay? You can have a job. You can have a job and make, I want to say, let's say make twelve fifty an hour. It's nothing wrong with that. You just figure out a plan for yourself. To where you can put money aside, and I know it's hard as hell. Trust you me, I've been there before. Hard as hell. Sometimes it do take you getting a second job and stuff like that. That's why I, I will tell y'all time and time again, I worked three jobs before. I worked three jobs before. Because one wasn't enough, then two wasn't enough. So I needed three. Because I needed one for the bills, I needed one to take care of my son, and I needed one so that I could save money. So I've been there, trust me, trust you me. And the process is not easy, but I promise if you put in that work, like really put in that work for a good six to nine months, maybe a year, maybe a year, you just sacrifice that time, sacrifice that time, sacrifice going outside, sacrifice, Spending that money on that frivolous shit. Sacrifice them six to nine to 12 months. And I promise you that's going to set you up for a great life. But it takes sacrifice. So please don't think, oh, I got an own fans and then I got a whole bunch of money and now I can take. No, it's not about being cash heavy. Cash don't mean shit to these people. Cash don't mean nothing to these people. They want to see that credit score. Then after you show them your credit score, then okay, let's see this proof of income. But that credit score matters. Being cash heavy is cool, being cash heavy is great because it can definitely fill in them boards for you for what your credit score is lacking. But at the same time, don't sit at the people's table and allow them to give you these high ass interest rates because your credit score isn't up to par. Don't borrow money from them people and let them people tax you on that interest. Don't let them do that. What you do is, it's just not time yet. It's just not time yet. You back away from that table and it's perfectly fine. Back away from the table and take some more time to get that credit score better. It'll be cheaper for you to get your credit score better or get your credit score up than to accept a five or ten year high interest loan. Believe me, I'm learning this. As I learn it, I share it. As I'm growing, I share it.
because each one needs to teach one. Okay? So don't look online. If you're looking online and you're seeing somebody that's constantly posting designer stuff, just know either one, they probably got their house already and they're established to where it doesn't affect them to buy these things. That's for one. And ain't nothing wrong with that. But then they also have those people that will sacrifice a living arrangement, meaning a living situation, like they will sacrifice having a place to stay for some fire Instagram pictures in Mexico or in um, Puerto Rico or in um, freaking Aruba or wherever. Like there are some people that their priority is just not there. And to each his own. You know what I'm saying? But if you know good and well, you are not comfortable with your living situation and you know that God has more for you and you know there's more out there for you, take that time of sacrifice and set your life up the way that you see you want to have it. Take that time to dedicate it to you, to yourself. Forget Instagram. Fall off the map for a little while. Fall off the map for a little while. If you're making money outside of social media, just fall off the map for a little while. Get real serious about you. And even that fall in line with your health. Like you could get real serious about your money and getting real serious about your money meaning that you got to budget in your, your diet. You know what I'm saying? You got to get real serious about your time. You got to get real serious about your money. You got to get real serious about you. You feel me? So, you know, it ain't nothing to go to the grocery store. I'm not going to hold y'all right now. I just bought a house and I just bought a car. And I'm fine. I'm good. But I feel like I could be greater. So, I'm about to be sitting online telling y'all go to RegaKFans.com. I'm in the grocery store. I'm buying groceries. I'm cooking every night. I got bottled waters up in here. I got everything I need in my house because... I don't need to be ordering no Uber Eats when I know I have a financial goal for myself because this ain't it for me. You know what I'm saying? So I'm taking my sacrifice right now too. You know what I'm saying? I, I, could, I bring my son out to eat, I want to say, once a week. Once a week I would take the time out and me and him, we would sit at a restaurant and we would talk. I could do that. But... After that, it's the summertime, the kids, they get bored, they want to eat. So, I'm not about to have this dude, I'm not about to have my son sitting on Uber Eats ordering, you no know, uh, two pieces of candy for no doggone $15. Hell no, we're about to go to the grocery store, we're about to go get everything that you're going to need for this next week, RT. <laughs> and we're going to be inside, you know what I'm saying? And ain't nothing wrong with that. It's nothing wrong with that. And y'all been seeing me lately. This has been my new investment. Because you do need to reward yourself. You know, reward yourself for your hard work. You do need to do that. But stay within your means and your reward. So this has been my reward to myself. My reward is my, my PJs. I love PJs from uh, matching PJs from Target. This has been my thing. So once a week when I go get my groceries and stuff, to go get my cleaning supplies and stuff, I will stop and I will get myself some fresh new PJs <laughs> from Target. And that's what makes me happy. You know what I'm saying? Like, for y'all, it is cool to, to want the nicer things, but you got to set yourself up for success to get there to where you don't have to just do it temporarily. You can make your dream your reality like your everyday all right, y'all. I'm being honest with y'all, man. So sincere. <laughs> but uh, I'm about to go, like I said, for my fans who are my only fans, meaning my only, you know, RegaKFans.com. I'm about to come holler at y'all next. We're on a different type of time. Y'all know what type of time we on. We're about to get y'all. Um, <laughs> 